welcome back. Today I have for you a long collective beauty haul full of drugstore, high-end, new products, and all that fun stuff. Many of you guys really like my previous one, so I decided to make another one for you guys. It's going to be a long one, so grab something to drink. And also, let me know in the comments below if there's any products that you would like to see a review on or feature in a video, and I will go out and do it for you guys. And without further ado, let's get started. Alright, so let's first start with Tarte. I ordered a few of their new products and I'm so excited to try these out because I swatched some of them and fell completely in love. First up, we have the Tarte Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation. This one is in Tan Sand, which is the same shade that I use for all their foundations. And I actually originally ordered this one a few months ago in Honey, I believe, and it was just way too dark for me. So I'm excited to try the right shade for me and see how it works. So let me know in the comments below if you want to see a first impression and I will gladly do it for you guys. I'm going to stop repeating that though, but just know that if you see any products that you want to see a review on, let me know. Something that I'm extremely excited to try out is their new highlighting palette. This one is the Rainforest of the Sea Skin Twinkle Lighting Palette. It has three different shades. I swatched it on an event and I fell in love with. That's what the packaging looks like. I'm obsessed with this collection, honestly. So here is what it looks like. It has a rosy pearl, a matte sand, and a champagne gold. That's what it looks like swatch right there. I absolutely love the two outside shades, the champagne and the rosy one. But the matte one barely comes out, like at all, at least on my skin tone. But the other two shades are absolutely stunning. I can't wait to try this out. We have the Tarlet in the Bloom palette. I am so excited for this, just because I feel like it's going to be the perfect palette for spring and that's what it looks like again packaging with tarte it's amazing especially because it has a lot of gold but here are the shades they're just neutral with shimmer and matte and i absolutely love their original tarlet palette so i can't wait to see how this one works next up is their tardiest contour palette and again packaging in this ah, i'm obsessed it's so beautiful Wow, I'm obsessed with the mirror. I think it's going to be a great palette to take to travel. And here are the shades. It has two dark contour shades, a correct, a highlighting, and a blush. And also a white shade in the middle, which I don't know if that's supposed to correct. And the last two products are from the Rainforest of the Sea line. This one is their setting spray. It also works as a moisturizer. And we have the deep cleansing gel, which I tried their sample. And they actually sent me another one. I am obsessed with this cleanser. Again, A plus on their packaging game. All right, so I got sent a bunch of goodies from Hard Candy, like a lot of products. So I'm just going to quickly mention them. And if you want to see a review on, you know the drill. Something that I'm super stoked and excited to try out are their new liquid lipsticks or velvet mattes. These are their velvet mousse matte lip color. The packaging though, it's to die for. They come in this little tint, I think you call it, like that. And it has a mirror. That's what it looks like. I actually have this color on right now. This one is Wisteria. You guys know how terrible I am pronouncing things, but I absolutely love the packaging as well. It's very sleek and chic, and then it has a little brush like this. Really like it so far. It's what I have on my lips right now, like I mentioned, and I believe they have eight shades or seven. I'm not too sure. I also got some of their lipsticks. I'm not sure the name of the collection, but I really love the packaging again. It has all the colors on the top, which is really easy to choose and pick. And the pigmentation in these, it's amazing. I'm absolutely loving it so far, and that's what it looks like. They have a blue, a light blue, a dark blue, a red, a yellow, like a super bright yellow, a nude, brown, pink, and purple. These are their cheek tints, which they're basically liquid blushes. I don't really like liquid blushes, though, so I'm just going to give them a try and see how they work and let you guys know. Two mascaras, which I love trying out new mascaras, especially drugstore, and this one is the dramatic length volume and the volume and fan effect liquid highlight this one is the illuminate and strobe mix drops which you could mix it with your foundation or your skin it has a little dropper which is pretty cool and then that's what it swatches like it's basically just a sheer glow this is something I'm really excited to try out is their sheer envy pore defense primer serum it's oil free silicone free and alcohol free so I can't wait to see how it works I'll let you guys know a setting spray which I love trying out new setting spray especially from the drugstore just because the drugstore doesn't really have many setting sprays this one is the sheer envy hydrating primer mist 12 hour power nice and you can actually use this two ways either as a primer or a setting spray we have two liquid liners this one is a two-in-one liner tip it has a fat side and a fine side it's really pigmented and you could use the fat side obviously and then the skinny or thin side and then we have the bold and gorgeous oh that's different that looks so cute let's see nice wow 
Oh, another liquid liner. This one is the Total Power Liquid Liner in Jet Black. Oh, nice. All day eyeliner, long wear liquid liner. Whoa, that's weird. Mm, I don't really know how I feel about this. Like, the brush is not really, you know, too helpful. But I do love the other two liners. Next, we have a 24-hour brown stain long wear, and it's actually in light medium, so I don't think I'll be able to use this, but it seems pretty nice. Brow setting gel. This one has a clear side to set your brows, and it's supposed to help with growing out your brows. Nice. And also a highlighting to highlight under your brows once you're done filling them in. Next is their Heavy Duty Concealer. I've heard many great reviews on it here on YouTube, so I'm excited to try it out. And it also has a beige nude liner. For your waterline holy cow that is extremely pigmented wow it reminds me of the Tarte um, concealer or the Mac concealer even it's so creamy really really like it. highlighting and contour stick this one is in the color deep it has a light side to obviously highlight and then a dark side to contour Wow Natalie oh nice I really like it because it's a cool tone deep color so it's not going to look too orangey on the skin and that's what it looks like then we have a illuminate and strobing stick I don't know how I feel about these like highlighting sticks I, I, I prefer powder but they're really pretty we also have another primer this one is the sheer envy primer lift and firm which is supposed to be good to moisturize brightens and tightens facial con wow nice Thanks. oh wow okay okay <laughs> Oh, it feels really nice actually, like it covered all the thin lines in my hand. I really like it. Now, something that I'm really excited to try out are these two kits. This one is the strobing kit and it has a brush that I'm like super excited to see how it works. If I could open it, of course. Oh my god, the brush is adorable and it's so soft too, nice. It's really, really good quality. I wonder how much these are. I'm going to put the price of most of the items right here for you guys but so far I really love this brush especially to like set your concealer seems to be really nice it has a strobing glow cream luminizer two highlights a bronzer and a blush I really like the blush the drugstore is stepping up their game these highlights are so pretty that's what it looks like and then we have the contour and sculpt kit I really love the packaging of these as well and it brings a brush so pretty nice and it's really good quality guys like I really love these brushes All right so it has three cream products a yellowish tone a lighter skin tone and a dark skin tone and then a bronzer and a highlight really love the highlight it's a little bit powdery but the color it's beautiful now last but not least from hard candy I got some nail polishes I love nail polish I probably paint my nails every day and I really love these nail polishes I've been trying out these two lately this one is the one that I have on right now which is called sky it's a beautiful baby blue color perfect for spring and this one is also pretty which is a pale pink it's such a beautiful color again and all of these bring a plastic ring which is so cute I used to love these when I was younger how adorable all right so these are now going to be a little bit more random I went to Target and Harman as you guys know Harman is my favorite store I truly love Harman so I went to two different trips first up is contact solution because I wear contacts if you didn't know um, some floss necessary I got this extra whitening sensitive toothpaste because my teeth have been extremely sensitive after I went to the dentist so I can't wait to see if this works on me because it's not funny some cotton rounds because I go through these like water I use them for my toner and makeup remover I got some baby wipes kind of deal to throw in the bag hair dye I actually decided to switch it up this one is from Revlon it's the blue black argan oil enriched three butters mango shea and coconut and it's actually ammonia free which is supposed to be better for your hair um, I basically have to dye my hair almost every month because I now get brown highlights since I had brown hair there you go don't dye your hair kids from target i got some cute little things first up is this chalkboard kind of deal to decorate my room some chalk to write on the chalkboard note cards i don't know why but i love collecting these and they're only a dollar and super adorable as well i actually like sending these whenever you guys win giveaways or to give gifts for people and stuff i really like these 
something fun and random that I found was this little crate thing which I got to put my paint in and it was only five dollars from Marshalls I got two things which were very necessary obviously not really this one is the guava kiwi candle guys first of all I don't I don't know how to describe this but it smells delicious like so so good I love dual home candles they just they last a really long time and they, they smell really good but what this reminds me of is the sweet pea fragrance from Bath and Body Works which I love but I feel like this smells a lot better to be honest with you <sighs> it smells so much like spring and something that you know was extremely necessary give paper wrap flamingo give paper wrap guys when I saw this I almost screamed and looked like a maniac but I absolutely love flamingos like ever since I was little the only animal that caught my attention were flamingos I absolutely love flamingos it's it's a little upsetting that so many people are obsessed with flamingos now but you know whatever it's cool but on the bright side there's more flamingo things because back in the day there was nothing flamingo talking about flamingos I went to Michael's and I got a scissor because it's necessary I actually funny story I went to the concert um Nikki Jam concert which I have a blog on if you want to go check it out but I went and I had this in my purse because I was cutting my extensions and I just left it there and the security guy was just looking at me like I was crazy like why do you have a large scissor at a concert he probably thought I was gonna commit a massacre or something god forbid but while I was waiting in line to pay for the scissor I found this flamingo stamp which you know I it just it, it speaks for itself it speaks for itself it's just things that you see in stores and you're like I'm I might need it someday you know All right so last but not least I wasn't sure if I was going to share this with you guys since I always show my unboxing on snapchat but I got a package from benefits a huge package from benefit oh Oh my goodness. First of all, when I opened this, as I mentioned my, you know, flamingo obsession, I swear to God I almost cried because this... Are you joking right now? So this is Flammy and basically me and Flammy are going to go to all the pool parties I get invited to with my drink in it. I, I, I just can't. I can't even. Um, I also got this little flower hula thing. So cute. And then we have the actual box, which is a humongous hula benefit bronzer. And inside, there's more benefit stuff. So again, I was extremely stoked about the flamingo itself, but this... Are you serious right now? It has my name! With the H, by the way, which is so hard for me to find things with my name spelled correctly. So thank you so much, Benefit. And then the brush has my name as well. It just doesn't get any better than that. I absolutely love this bronzer, by the way, because it's the perfect shade. I also got a hula bronzer for your skin. The packaging is to die for. It's like a little hula thing. So adorable. And it has a little sponge in the bottom. And then the actual uh, product do the hula which is a soft matte liquid bronzer for your face again super cute packaging i can't wait to try this out i feel like it's going to be perfect for spring break this one is a bronzing and contour brush i'm obsessed with this guys you have to see the packaging it's like a little palm tree or a bamboo i love it it's so soft as well and it's my favorite color turquoise Last but not least is a mini Hula Benefit bronzer, which is so adorable. It's extremely tiny compared to the original size. So cute. So, so cute. Again, thank you so much, Benefit. Can't wait to try these out. So that is pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to give it a thumbs up if you like it. Also, let me know in the comments below if you want to see any lip swatches, reviews, whatever you like. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. And see you next time. Bye. Dude, are you freaking kidding me? Uh, how you call that when like it just you know okay all right moving on oh damn it they're fresh quads and they're only a dollar so why not i also got hmm, hair in my mouth